everybody. I was watching soap videos the other day and actually saw a new technique, well, new to me, um, that I wanted to try. So I've got our oils here, our lye water here. Um, I'm going to be using some white titanium dioxide. Inside that, I'm going to do Sparkle Me Aqua and Sparkle Plenty. That'll give it a good shine once the bar is cured. And then Flirt. And ballet slippers and our fragrance today is pink sands all right so let's get started all right we have hit like trace I'm gonna divide off the batter Scrape the big bucket. Make sure we get all the soap out. All right, we're going to start adding in our colors. Gotta let the water get hot so it can mix the titanium dioxide. I'm going to get these blended and then I will add in the fragrance oil. I'm going to bring the mold in. Get these out of the way. And we are going to do it in the pot swirl.
gotten a little thick, so I'm going to just shove it down in there a little bit. This scent is the perfect summer scent, in my opinion. It's one of my favorites. Alright, we're going to start pouring. I'll probably have to tap part of the way through. the new technique. They took gold mica, mixed it with some batch oils, and poured down and just let it run where it wants. The soap will absorb it, but it will leave behind some of that gorgeous gold. And here's the close-up of the soap. I cannot wait to cut this one. Hopefully on the inside where I poured the gold mica will make it look kind of marbled. But we'll see. This one may have to sit for more than 24 hours, but y'all will be with me when I cut it. Alright, so we're back for the cut. Hope this comes out good. Just my little marker here. All right, here we go. There's some of the marbling that the gold left. I think I'm going to make the bars a little thicker.
we did get some glycerin rivers in it um that doesn't mean the bar is bad it just most people don't like it when they're making soap that's just due to the titanium dioxide most of the time